Alright, today I'm going to be showing you how to install a wireless card or replace a wireless card in a Dell Vostro 1500 or a Dell Inspiron 1525 or similar. Now, this computer is unique and pretty nice in that it has three slots for wireless expansion. Um, so before we do anything, we're going to want to unplug our power and our battery for safety and to make sure we don't mess up the computer. Uh, on this computer there's a panel which is marked with C which just stands for card. So we're gonna unscrew the panel just like so. Alright, so now we've got the card cover off and we can see here we've got three different slots for wireless cards. We've got a WPAN spot which is wireless personal area network and we've got WAN which is wireless wide area network. FCM is an optional, mo optional module in this computer which allows it to um, run faster. It was never very fully explored by Dell, so I don't have one of those to show you how to install, but it would install in much the same way where you, which is what I'm going to show you. I've got a new card that I'm going to install here. I'm going to take it out of this packaging. And this, if you've ever installed RAM before, is much the same thing. You're going to install it at an angle. Uh, this is actually about like a 30 degree angle maybe. And all I'm going to do is press it down. Uh, this is a great setup because you don't have to do anything special about it. Uh, some computers you're going to have to screw this down. This one just has little clips. It works great and it's really easy. Um, so, now we need to attach antennas so it can get a connection. This computer has a total of six antennas. Uh, they're stored in a little mylar sheath right there. I've already selected uh, this dark gray cable and the black and dark gray cables. Uh, the reason I selected those was due to looking at the user's manual. They detail which antennas you should use for which purposes, and these were the closest match to uh, what I needed. The other two are designed more for uh, WAN purposes. So I'm going to put those back in the sheath um, while I do this. Now. As I was talking, I mindlessly connected the cables without telling you what I was doing. What happens is these are very small, fragile connectors, so you need to make sure you get them directly up on top of the connector on the card itself and press it down. Now, if you're having trouble pushing it down, it should be a fairly easy matter. If you're having trouble, it's on wrong. Uh, you're just going to want to push down lightly, and if it doesn't work, uh, reposition it and try again. Removing it is also a very simple matter. Usually I'm just going to grab the cable here and pull it up. Is the easiest way for me because I have big fat fingers and I can't do it any other way. Um, now we're all set here, so I'm going to screw the panel back on and put the computer back together. Reinstall our battery. Plug back in our power. And we're good to go. You just installed the card in your Dell Vostro 1500. Thank you very much for watching.